That's why we are fascists. <laughs> <laughs> yes, and there are all sorts of names and you know yeah look uh aisha mm. the true idiot is the person who does not learn from history mm. that's the true idiot i am blessed to have lived a full cycle i've been here before i was here in 1993 that's where we're we're back in 1993 in the immediate aftermath of the election i remember making this point but a lot of people didn't hear me because they were emotional and also because a lot of us have learned to subjectify the truth mm. because it is uh mr a it is no longer true but when it is mr b mm. it becomes true i have seen some of my dear friends who have celebrated the electoral theft by Tinubu, not necessarily because they love Tinubu, but because they have taught themselves to hate Peter Obi, and they imagine that it is Peter Obi's loss. They conveniently ignore the fact that it is our collective loss. If Peter Obi becomes the standard by which you tell the truth if his involvement shades the truth for you if it makes the truth less true then you should look at yourself not at the man but what you're seeing today is a situation where because we have lived these cycles we can recognize where we are at in 1993 by this time, they had turned Abiola's mandate into a Yoruba mandate. They had begun the process. And that was exactly what Inubu and his courts have attempted to do. They've attempted to make the Peter Obi mandate an Igbo mandate, a Christian mandate. Mm. It's always been their case. They always find how to reduce popular mandates to narrow lines so that they might then talk about it as though it was not national in nature and it was only sectional. So that's what they've labored very hard to do with Peter Obi. The most obvious of the lies was to, was to have attempted to target an Igbo mandate, conveniently forgetting that the same man won, I'm saying so full chest, he won in Nasarawa, he won in Taraba, he won in Plateau, he won in Benue. Are you getting me? He won significant yeah, votes yeah. in places where they would once upon a time have merely said, did not voted this way, or did not this, did not that. Subsuming human beings behind ethnic tags. But for once, Nigerians came together as one, and as they did in 1993, they are attempting to do now divide the people along lines so that they might legitimize what they have stolen. But unfortunately for them, and fortunately for us, we have seen it before. It's not going to work this time around. We are not doing, we are not playing that ethnic game. And it's not about religion. They wanted it to be about religion from day one. Mm. Muslim, Muslim ticket. The same people who wanted everything to be about religion, and the ones turning around accusing others of religiosity. The same people who wanted it to be about ethnicity are the same ones turning around, branding it an ethnic. So when you've seen these cycles, you would understand very quickly that in reality, Peter Obi is a biola in this cycle. Sinubu is a bacha. Mm. And that dotard in Aso Rock that you call Buari, that's Babangida, lame duck, complicit in evil, incapable of delivering on the promises of a nation. That's what you are saying. So we've seen this cycle before. We will not tire of telling the truth. If it means going into another cycle as we did in 93, we will. But the one thing that is clear, Nigeria cannot call itself a democracy and enthrone an electoral criminal. 
as his president. It's not possible. This judicial system would have to decide whether it is truly the last hope of the poor man or whether it is part and parcel of the evil that Nigeria has been governed by for decades. It didn't begin with Buhari. It's always been there. But this is the most brazen it has ever been. And it will be entirely up to us to reject this or embrace it. <laughs> you can count on me to reject this. This is not happening. I'm not, it's not happening with my consent. It's not going to happen. <laughs> it won't happen. If I'm the only person standing saying it won't happen, so be it. At least these people will record there was a, okay, there was an insane one amongst them. Yes, there was an insane one. It's, it's, it's better to be insane than to be, to, to believe in